Shatter jabs. I have the high ground. You underestimate my power. Don't try it. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the video. I'm so hyped for this one. It's gonna be a banger. Uh, thanks for the support on the last video. It crushed over 400 views. Well, uh, just looking at it right now. So, uh, while I'm talking right here, here's some some of the memes me and the boys drew up. Pretty funny. You already know. I So, make sure to like, sub, comment, like the video. All the support means a lot. Alright, let's get right into it. So first of all guys, we're going to be reviewing my first video, what happened in that one, and then Batter's video, Expose on me, <laughs> and then Jab's little one. Ah, uh, so much proof coming in guys, thanks for all the proof, make sure you DM me the proof, and uh, let's get right into it. So right here guys, we got all the hate comments Batter and his gang got up, then all of his gang, they just made all the accounts after all the accounts just saying, you know, spam and you know, even some of them said the N word, you already know. So disgusting, man. And if that's not even enough for you, just all of this, uh, we have the thumbnail right there that's a racist. So, right there, obviously, you can see this little thing on my head. It's uh, people wearing the sun in Africa and stuff like that. So, I don't know what he's trying to say here, obviously, racist. So, right here in this picture, uh, Batter Singh. I said the N word. Obviously, I've been telling everyone this like two years ago and stuff. I don't know what these kids be saying. Two years ago, it's a long time. If anyone knows me now, I've been working every single day to get anyone doing any racist things. Like right now, Batter, all the kids in my blacklist server getting blacklisted for being racist against community guidelines. I've also made up for all that and uh, I've done my time. And next off here we have them saying that I'm abusing powers and false banning people for no reason. Like, okay, that makes no sense. That's not proof of me abuse of powers. First off, you need proof of me, proof of me banning them, the proof I used to ban them. And if that's false or not, then you can claim that I am. But even before that, we make humans, we make mistakes. I could always be false. If you always come to me saying, yo... Uh, you didn't see this, it's not legit, I'll always fix it. So Batter here is claiming that this is why I got disabled. All this is probably just not true. I'm not even going to read it out to you, not even a point. You could just tell this is just some bullshit. Um, there's no proof to back whatever they said. Um, and you can see up in there, and they sent this message on 2020. My account is over two years old. How the hell have I been disabled when my account is that old? So in this picture right here, it shows me uh, blacklisting YTRY for an alt account saying that YTRY and Batter owns me. That's the, the guy saying it. And, uh, remember that effing name and then a bunch of other cuss words whatever right so obviously if you see that he's raiding the server by the way and we're getting raided a lot and you see that you know it's obviously that I'm like come on it's it's not even a question so basically the story goes that I post this and then YTRY comes in he's like oh I'm gonna appeal it he appeals it and then he explains to me that yo this could be anyone to be honest and he said he would never raid or whatever, right? And in his defense, yeah, that's true. So we took down the blacklist, right? It's not false or abuse. We took it down. So I don't know how this is proof of me being false or abusing my powers. We took it down. We were good. There's no problem here. So right here in this picture, uh, it's kind of small, but I'll explain what happens. Basically, I'm telling this guy, you can't middleman without the middleman. Obvious. I don't have to explain that there. And then he still says, right after I verbally warn him not to do it, he still says, I still do it without the rule. So I'm obviously going to warn him for breaking the rules. I don't know what's the problem with that. So right here we have uh, Batter just just DMing people in general, 
telling them to dislike my vid, just hating on it. Like, there's no, there's no point or reason to do that. Just so disgusting. And then what he calls me at the end, you could just read that. Just totally un, uh, unnecessary and disgusting. And here's some other comments that we missed. Right here, we just got more of his followers. Here, just you could just see so racist and stuff. Just his gang attacking my friends and stuff. Right here, we literally have a batter in the announcement saying the N word. Like, come on. Like, what more proof do I need here? And here we have YTR mods. See, he's thinking I banned him, and that's like why he hates me, I think. It was actually fear, but he technically has no proof of me banning him. It's kind of sad. First off, you can never take proof like this. this th th you have no context of what's happening here. First off, we have someone deleted user. If you F with us one more time, it's a permo ban. Um, he's just, uh, obviously, if you're going to mess with us, meaning break the rules, you're going to get banned. I don't know what else to explain there. And then people were thinking, like, I could do everything. So I said, I'm not Superman. You know, Superman's powers and whatever. And then autocorrect, whatever. And then I think he broke the rules after I said that. And I said, you're F. And then I probably banned him. And then... Y'all keep defending him, saying, oh, MFG, I need, okay, oh, I think I said I need a break, because uh, some of the kids were just being so unreasonable. There's nothing here, I don't know why this is proof. Uh, like I said, they just took it out of context, which isn't right. So, before we start on Jab's video, this is literally what he said. Uh, this is not to me, by the way. Um, he said, hey, I saw your comment. Yes, you are correct. The video doesn't involve a lot of evidence. And other parts were mainly just to make the video long. So basically, he's admitting there's literally no evidence on it. Um, and he was just trying to make the video long, obviously, for YouTube reasons. And then the reason that I made the vid was because of him, uh, me saying the N-word. Um, which obviously, he says here, that I understand this was two years ago, basically. Yes, that's true. Uh, have a golden still blacklist of people for things that happened years ago, which is not true. We have a six-month policy. And if you don't believe me, we just, my staff team, just went, um, last night, we went over the all of the blacklists and made sure they're not expired or anything like that, just to make sure, you know? And then the main reason he made this video, it says that uh, people were spamming his DMs. Obviously, he says in the video, this was for Badder, and then all those people spamming his DMs. You see how Badder and his gang treats it, other people just like Jabs, just totally incorrect, so, so disgusting to see. So, right here, he has a picture of Hungry Hippo in my DMs. Um, he thinks that, um, he, I was, like, forcing him to blacklist someone. That's why he didn't. That's not the story. The story is, I didn't want Hippo to be, uh, influenced by the wrong people, a.k.a. Batter. He was talking to him. And I don't want Batter influencing my Blanco server. We gotta stay professional and everything like that. So, I obviously told him if you're going to be friends with him, you're obviously going to be supporting what he does, obvious, or you you would be knowing that he knows that. And I didn't want him to be influenced. That's just the that's the big deal. Me and Hippo are not friends. We're chilling out. There's no problem. I don't know why that's proof. And the photo right under that is me getting banned from Ride YT. That was that one picture two years ago that they used to get me banned. I don't really care. The person who banned me, uh, <laughs> false banned me. Uh, they ban me, I don't really care about getting unbanned. I've said this before, but I'll say it again. Me getting banned from a server isn't proof of me doing anything wrong. The proof they use to ban me is the proof that you need to look at if I've done anything wrong. And obviously, to be honest, it was two years ago, and if their policy is, you doesn't matter how long ago, that's their policy. But like I said, it's just kind of corrupt, and I don't care. So this is the picture he used here. This is not actually the full picture, but I'll explain it to you guys. Um, basically we have Prince, he's warning someone for spam, good job, and then in that same minute, you see the Me6 message, you can't see it, but right under that message, I warn him again, they're thinking that I warned him for no reason because I hate him, I don't hate anyone, hate is a strong word, it's only used in the heat of the moment, um, but I sent it in that same minute, meaning this was all sent like under like a second or two of time, so, uh, I obviously removed one of the ones as it would have been false and I was I didn't mean to double warn him. That was just obviously in the second we sent it at the same time.
So right here, I'm busy, obviously. I'm telling him I'm busy, so I'm not going to be paying much attention to what he says, but I'm going to still see what he wants. And he says, sorry, but you and better say that law are racist when I have proof of you saying the hard R. And then I tell him, obviously, it's two years ago, and then he still says it's racism. Yeah, it's still racism, but like I've said before, I have uh, every day I've been making up for what I've said and anyone who knows me knows that I'm not that type of person anymore and we have a six month policy on my blacklist server due to people who change so right here I accidentally called him so I just accident that's nothing and then I'm not gonna even explain it's a waste of my time shaking my head I don't know why he says SMH is so much hate I don't know where he got that from but I meant shaking my head that's what it means uh there you go um I don't like to talk to people give me that type of attitude if you're willing to try to see what the problem is and not be a un, like annoying and stuff like you're coming at me if you're going to come at me i'm not going to explain it to you there's no point in wasting my time on someone who's not going to listen like you you literally said so bro it's still racism if you don't understand that then there's no point in talking to you and then you said expose vid calming whatever uh i'm countering this about expose it's so hard right now this is a video of Batterman and his gang made. It's so obviously fake. Like, my profile picture just looks so weird. Um, just look how fake this is. Like, even if it's not fake, which it isn't, it's obviously Photoshop. There's no no proof of me saying this anywhere. Um, this just slivers. There's no context. How can you judge someone off no context? Like, you got another context, and there's no context here. Like I said, um, in the beginning, he literally says himself that the the proof it was just trying to it wasn't even real or anything i forgot what he says but you can go back and see uh most of the stuff he talks about isn't really right it makes no sense and he says there's so much pressure on people um when they're on discord they're saying like uh he says it's like school like you come on you uh you you could play with your mates that's what he says and then you gotta follow the rules isn't that what life is if you break a, a, a law or a rule you can i don't know face charges go to jail it's the same i don't know why you're saying that this is wrong there are rules in place for a reason people break the rules just like you guys are there for a reason it seems like you guys don't want the rules so you can break the rule or so that you can roam free and that's what the blacklist server is trying to stop you know i'm pretty successful so before we start, while recording this video, I saw the video Ikri did and the one uh, Bear did. Bear was really long. I'll review that probably in another video or something, but the uh, Ikri video, video is like 56 seconds long. I could do that real quick in this one. So here's your cloud Ikri. Basically, this kid made a 56 second long video where he views my video and all he says is no one gives a f, f no one gives an F. Like, that is so sad like it's sad in so many ways he's obviously looking for clout because my video did so well it's kind of sad that he did it provides no evidence he just did it for clout so obvious very sad and it seems like bad was just getting all of his friends because then who's next bear made the next video don't worry guys i'll be reviewing that these kids are not going anywhere uh next video will probably be on him or something else i'll have to see but you can wait your you can wait your turn, Bear. Uh, seems like I've won the first battle. Obviously, just countered everything they said with clear evidence and proof. Very sad. So also in Ikri's video, he literally he he says that and he skips the whole video, just saying that very stupid. Um, shows how it, in like not tell intelligent he is. Literally at the beginning, he says, uh, what did he say? I'm not gonna take any sides like <laughs> right when he starts it's so obvious he's kind of like jeez man he says he's not gonna take any sides and then immediately starts saying no one gives an F it's kind of funny just watching the whole video kind of clowning himself uh, well that's his problem very sad and that's all guys uh, make sure to like sub and uh, share the video it's a banger remember we won the war don't worry don't worry what they said their dislikes we don't care about the dislikes here they can go ahead and do the same thing it's sad that they think they won the first battle or i guess yeah battle when they can't even provide clear evidence and when they do provide like some evidence we just easily counter this video is so easy thanks for your support guys you know what to do and i'll see you in the next one
Right.